Okay, I'm back with part two of my Etsy restock videos. Uh, these three little journals are all Valentine's journals. And um, I'm going to back out a little bit here so you can see them a little bit better. Um, these are cinch-bound journals. They're similar in their makeup. They are all Valentine's, and they have similar things in them. But the papers are different, the tags are different, so I am going to flip, flip through the three of them. So uh, the covers I've done with jelly prints, and, um, and then I've used modeling paste for the decoration on the top. And then let's just flip through. Um, again, a jelly print to start off with, a little library card. These are um, not coffee dyed. They are, as, as they are, I've embellished them a little with stickers and, and things. Each book has some vintage, um, vintage magazine in them. And lots of room for journaling, as you can see. Decorative papers. Um, file folder. Um, some dictionary page. Here's another one of the vintage magazine pages. A little note paper. Just some really pretty decorative papers in these. And then in the middle of each one, there's one of these pockets that I've decorated a little bit, a flash card, and each one has one of these little uh, Valentine's tablets. And then on the other side, each one has one of my mixed media tags that has um, vintage, uh, vintage uh, Valentine's on them, stickled and decorated up and that kind of thing. So there's one of those in there. Um, that's a vintage cookbook. Another little sticker. Another vintage cookbook. Some tickets tucked there at the top of that one. And this little pocket has yet another one of my mixed media tags with the vintage Valentine on it. Okay, so that is, that's the first one. And um, they're going to be listed, this will be Valentine's uh, mixed media journal number one. So this will be number one. And then... This one will be number two, again, with the jelly print and the modeling paste on it. Let's see, get you in frame here. And um, again, a jelly, this is jelly plated, or jelly printed um, music paper. And then I've got the little catalog card there. Again, the vintage magazine. And some dictionary and some stamping and stickers. So there's room for journaling and there's room for, you know, doing some sort of memory spread or art journal page or whatever on the decorative papers. There's the dictionary page, the folder. And then this one has a bingo card and, again, the little tablet. And then on this side, this one, I was so lucky that my mom saved my, um, my Valentines from my childhood. And so I just copied them to create these tags. They're so fun. Um, here's the vintage magazine page in this one. And just pretty papers. It was fun to just use a variety of papers in these. 
dictionary page and here's a playing card that's the eight of hearts another vintage page and here's here's one of my vintage Valentine tags <clears throat> it was fun to incorporate the mixed media and I have to shout out to Lottie Faith who said Gail you should be incorporating some of your mixed media stuff into your journals so Lottie I took your advice on these three so that's number two this one is number three it's very light I hope you can see it in my poorly lit area here um, so this one once again is a jelly print and then it's got it's got the modeling paste again a jelly print on music paper and the library card some sticker little bag vintage There's a doily that you can play with. The file folder. Whoops. There's a writing page in between each decorative page. So if I miss some of those. <laughs> okay, and then this one has... Um, has a catalog card that had this red on top so I thought it would work for this and then again a little tablet some stickers and decoration and this side here's the here's the cute little tag on this one and then more decorative this is a jelly print as well and another one of the tags and there we go that is number three so these are the three Valentine's journals that will be appearing shortly in the shop. And I am going to stop this video and do the last two, which are five ring binder journals. Uh, I'll do those separately. So I'll see you in part three. Thanks.